All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode. What is that, a comrade? Mm -hmm. Anyways, out here with Devin. What's up guys? Out of his St. Pete mansion. About a 500 square foot mansion. Yep. Out here on the me. tandem kayak, fishing for some trout. Plan is to do a catch and cook. Hopefully it can go. <laughs> what happened to it? What <laughs> I'm starting with the spook. He's starting with the popping cork. Hopefully get on some good trout to cook up. But had one bite. As you guys saw, oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Come back! That's three bites, three casts, guys. Three. <laughs> no, <laughs> four casts. Three bites, four casts. Oh god! Hey, it's gonna be a good day, hopefully. All right, guys. I'm aware that there's a smudge or blur on either the lens or case. Um, I don't know how I didn't realize that during the video or before I put the GoPro on. So I apologize for that. Hope you guys still enjoy the video. It's a freaking banger. So. Keep watching and leave a like and subscribe and all that good stuff. And um, see you at the end. Oh, there's one. Is it a trout? Oh, nice trout, baby. This is my PB trout. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, get in! Here, here! I wanted to. Oh, lip him! I wanted to get him in. This is my PB trap. Oh no! Oh no! You done did it. There we go. First fish on deck. Too big, I think. Bigger than 20 inches. Oh my! He almost got me. Hook. My guys, trout number one. I would say about. Let me say 20, 23. Maybe. Yeah, 22. 23. Not 23. I'll get in a second. Anyways, measured him on my rocks. We forgot a tape. He's a little too big, so we're going to toss him back. Hey, your phone and mine. See you later, fish. That broke my PB. That probably almost hit eight inches. There went one over there. Oh, I don't know what a one. This is ridiculous. <laughs> they freaking love that thing. <laughs> I was just casting the whole time with my mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a tiny one, like really tiny. Probably not even any trout over here. <laughs> oh my god. We're so quiet. No trout over here. Oh yeah, come here. Let me see your lure. <laughs> oh, I, I forgot it. We we're keeping any fish. Oh man. Hey, we'll get the next one. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh 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 oh. oh. Yeah. Let me lip him. Lip him. No troubles. I'm not scared to now. See a keeper now. Lost the leg. Uh, he looks long, but... <laughs> Come here. Get him! Keeper. Keeper. Is he? Yeah. Keeper trout, baby. Yeah, that's for sure a keeper. He's probably, it's probably exactly like 19. Yeah. I'd say 19. Oh, so Pecker, yeah, first Pecker keeper yeah, of the day son. on the DOA. Love He's it. barely hooked. Where's the stringer? I think it's under all this stuff. Yeah. First keeper. Pop bot Devin. You may want to pop a cork and that's spook a little bit, just maybe. Huh? Yeah. That one, the first one I caught. Oh, that's a good that's one. A giant. That's a nice one, boys. That's oh. A giant. You got the grips. Hey, you got to watch out for the rope, though. Oh. That's what I was saying. Is it bigger than my other one? Uh, I think so. Can I grab him? Uh, grab him! Oh! <laughs> Get him in the bow! <laughs> there he's good. <laughs> Lip him! Lip him! Lip him! Yes! Alright, that's our what, third trout? Third trout we landed? Third one. 
another long one. It's too long. Probably 22. Long? Yeah. 22. Another beautiful fish up. Look how pretty they are. On the yeah, spook. Man. Don't take my grips. I'll let you go. Go. Get out. Get out of here. Alright guys. Probably can't hear me. <laughs> <laughs> but we try to jump him back in and it's super windy and tip the yak. <laughs> Tell me you're going in. Go. Oh shit, the paddles. <laughs> yeah! Woo! Alright, take the f out. We need to get out of here. Do we have everything? Sure. Hopefully. Yeah! Whee! Made it to land. We aren't gonna die today, boy. One keeper trout for the day. That's a keeper. He's a small guy. Gonna get any more because, you know, Mother Nature hates us and wanted us to stop fishing. At least we got the catch and cook. Yeah, just one. How's it going, guys? All right, so this is the trout we caught. I say a good 17 inch. So what you want to do with trout? You don't want to follow the backbone because these fish have the skin. They don't have the scales. And it's a lot easier. Just do the way I do. All right. We'll see. So you want to go right behind the fin. You want to get a pretty sharp knife. This knife's not too sharp, but it's. I mean, it's just decent, you know. All right, then you want to just feel it with a knife. I'm not no professional, so just bear with me. And then just feel with the bone. Just like that. Just like that, right there. Wow. Yeah. You want to just back and forth your knife like that. And you can use this as like a little holder, a little gill right there. All right. Just feel the bone. And stop by right there. Flip her on over. Not that bad. And then what you want to do is, this is this is a little bit more difficult part, especially when you don't have room like I do. All right, so what you want to do is first you gotta get a grip. It's like this. Can't get a grip yet. Okay. You want to just bend the knife like this and get get a grip and just. This. Boom. Oh. Then you get good old white meat. Trout, mm -hmm. baby. That's how you do it, guys. Alright, so, so we're going to cook some uh, speckled trout. Uh, first thing we're going to do here is we're going to crank our stove up here on high. We're going to get it hot, right? And I always like to start off with some olive oil, alright? Because I, butter typically burns real fast. So I want to season my pan with a little oil, a little olive oil, just a little bit. And while that's heating up, come over here, take our, our, little, our little baby fillets here, and uh, we just drop a little, drop a little, little pepper on there, you know? Get with a little pepper. Come back with a little, a little salt. Not too much salt because the rest of the season is going to have some salt in it. Touch of garlic powder. Maybe not this one. Maybe we'll use a different one. A little Old Bay to give it a little seafood flavor. You don't want to put too much of it though. Just a little bit. Just a touch of smelling sachets, but be careful with that because it's very, very salty. I like uh, this product right here. It's black and seasoned. Works good on uh, chicken, seafoods, things like that. You probably have to order it online though. It's a small company in New Orleans makes it. I just put a little bit of Italian seasoning on there. I don't buy like parsley, basil, all that stuff that's all in here already. But I just put a little bit in right now, but as we cook, I'll add it later um, because the, the the season will kind of burn on there. So just kind of flip it over and repeat. Here. Now, an important thing here to remember is to always make sure that your fish is uh, dry. Um, in this case, it was sitting out for a little while, so it's dry enough so it doesn't flake. I mean, it doesn't uh, doesn't turn to mush. So my pan's pretty hot. I'm just going to drop a little butter in there. Too much oil. Get 
that going. Turn my heat down to about medium. Pan's good and hot. Let that mud butter melt. We're out of uh, garlic bread. Drop a little minced garlic in right now. Or crush a piece of garlic. So what you do with your fillet is you come back and you just want to kind of catch the sides of it. And just make sure the seasoning's on all, all the sides. So kind of pat it now. No wrong rules. Away from your body. So it doesn't splash up and get you. Now we're cooking. And we'll flip it over now. It's only been cooking about two minutes. So go ahead and flip it. Oops. Good. Now I'm showing my Italian seasoning, I'll just dust it a little bit, just very lightly dust that top. But I'm going to put some in the pan itself, that way the, the fish kind of pick up the, the, the aroma, I guess. And in about two minutes this fish will be done. About four minutes, yep, it's done. I'm going to let that rest for a minute. All meats I like to let rest, just let it sit and just kind of finish cooking. Alright guys, now time to try the fish that Jason cooked. Got some speckled trout um, pans here, so let's try it. Looks good, it looks a lot better than the fish I cooked. <laughs> Get it, go. Yeah. Oh, it's just falling apart. It's so good. So much better than fish I cook. <laughs> I'm gonna bring my fish here from now on. Good stuff. <laughs> Alright guys, that's going to be the video. Big thanks to Devin for inviting me out and thanks to Jason for cooking that fish. I cannot cook fish for crap. I suck at cooking it. Every time I cook it, it's just fried because that's the only way I know how to cook it. And he made it delicious. Way better than any fish I could cook. You know, I could cook some other stuff pretty good. I'm a pretty good chef, but not really with fish. If you want to see more saltwater videos or catch cook videos, make sure to leave a comment down below letting me know and I'll for sure do some more because it was really fun. Like always, leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next video.